good day Asia and good day world. Good morning Asia and good day world. So today I have to uh, start to to report you as on spectator.com that provide the information and data from, from NASA to First of all, okay, I should show you the, the main set. I will start from the, the left to the right, in the, from the all the basic information from NASA to the fact that we have found by ourselves and by myself. So right now, you have to realize that most of the affair happen at the east limb of the sun, not in the middle or on the west. When they rotate, when the sunspot rotate to this area at the west of the sun, there are so many affair or before to the east. They are the huge affair more than X5 or X10. So in this direction should have some star or something that have influence to our sun. It makes our sun to release the huge explosion of the solar fair. And you have to keep in mind that solar fair and solar storm they are not the same. But solar storm coming up after solar fair, let's say like this. This should be some spot uh three one eight six right it had produced the solar fair in the fetching with the high radiation x-ray uv gamma ultraviolet what whatever it is and those radiation had hit earth effect to human life people animals and pen after it had the solar fair fetching with radiation they shall release the CME or charged particle or plasma, huge amount from the spot to the spade. Because of the angle of that sunspot, it not facing Earth, so the CME or the solar storm are not really direct hit Earth, but the sun rotate at the cycle, right? Later on, about five to seven days, those CME will hit earth with a small or moderate impact therefore this one sunspot 318 had released solar fair hit earth but solar storm it doesn't directly hit our earth mm. Right now, the sunspot, let's say about one third of the sunspot have about two life cycle. Some sunspot have three life cycle. What does this mean? It means this here, this area, the sunspot that fell to the earth. When that sunspot rotate to the back side or the far side of the sun, it coming back at the second low. And some sunspot coming back at the third low. Right now, uh, from last December, there are so many sunspots that come back for the second round and have produced the energy to Earth about M class and A class. My system still not good function, so the animation right here. That's coming okay later on. Right now, uh, we see the image that released by NASA. The sunspot rotate from this one from left to right, or we call it the east and the west. The sunspot rotate like this. What does this mean? It means if the sunspot 3181 right here had released the solar fair and solar storm of course it will impact earth directly 
and sunspot 3182 the same any sunspot that rotate plus to this line north to south we have the direct impact to earth the sunspot 3184 if it deletes the air or air fair it not really direct impact to earth with solar storm onto earth but the fact that many people ask me why why uh, the sunspot that deletes the solar fan solar storm did not impact earth because of when I have take a look by myself with the Nikon P1000 camera in the morning I found that sunspot rotation not from left to right it form bottom up something like here what does this mean it means sunspot 3181 not in this position but in this position so if it does release solar fan solar storm it not really hit earth it above the earth earth around this area not hit earth with the sunspot 3182 if it in this angle it will not the solar storm will not hit earth but solar fan definitely hit our earth and in the evening the same thing sunspot 3181 in this position it it leaves the solar fan hit earth but not solar storm and the same sunspot 3182 the solar storm may be hit earth with the moderate enter in the morning and in the afternoon it different that's why right now so many times that uh, last NASA said that the mina it overestimate or underestimate though their prediction is not really on cost as period before 2017 in the morning sun rotate bottom up in the afternoon sun rotate top down like this before last August it not the the anchor like it, it bottom up directly 90 degree and in the afternoon directly 90 degree it means the anchor about 180 degree different nothing the same do you think the sun the sun had a wobble I don't think so our earth wobble This is why we have to calculate the impact time and the impact region by ourselves. Uh, they cannot provide the, the, the full information to us. In the past seven days, solar second fifth is growing up and rapidly after January 1st, New Year's. I don't know what what a correlation between the last year and this year but it rapidly generated so many solar fare more than 50 C more than 14 M and about 4 A class not really good and the potential it should be the egg fare within 24 hours because I have observed the solar energy and many information uh, that released by NASA. Of course, their raw information is good, but we have to calculate or we have to manage those data by ourselves. Otherwise, we could not make the prediction to warn our people. There are many solar solar fire, solar storm. This animation this information is based on the anchor of the NASA image. So many things is not really correct. It not really the fact. This animation is better. There's so many huge solar fire, right? That going down, not hit the earth. But believe me, because the sun rotates like this. Even it got the solar storm extend at the far side. Later on, 
7 day 10 day those energy will move to hit earth with the few impact moderate impact or hard strong impact it up to the energy that release from the sun we have to look deep inside the sun that why nasa have different angstrom of the radiation to take the photo down about 50 million kilometer 40 million 30 million 10 million 5 million 2 million before the energy inside the sun pop up to the surface and release energy to the space we can predict when the sunspot will happen when corona hope will happen because that information from east and storm that the nasa had take the photo inside to the sun something like this you can see that look like different color but it's dead something down below This is why they know up front when sunspot will happen, in which location, in which area, latitude, longitude on the sun. The sun right now is like this. So many sunspots, so many fair on around the sun. Any fetching solar fair, right? We will release radiation to hit Earth. Don't forget, X ray is not good for our DNA or our chromosome. Even the ultraviolet or with the gamma ray is not good at all. Even we walk on the ground, if you got the hue solar fair like that, we have been, let's say that, X ray. <laughs> by the sun. X-ray through our body is not good. That's why the air crew, the pilot, okay? Right now they change the, to be the risk, least danger, something like that, right? That means about the radiation least person. Because they fly about 10.5 kilometer or sometimes 12 kilometer above the earth surface. So they will be absorb the radiation from the sun easily than us because lower on the earth on the earth surface we have so many trees many moistures many human human humidity it's soft not as on the airplane especially when we fly from somewhere to the north pole and going down at the north pole you will get more radiation than the other Latitude. I have set up about, let's say, at least thirty five application on my mobile phone. So the, the data from each application will wake me up or warning me by the signal. I set up the, let's say that if there's the other, this, uh, the danger information, it have to warn me or alarm me at any time, even at night for the moderate, but close to my location about 1500 kilometer it must warning me and the other information that not really will create the mega disaster at night it not make noise right here right now you can see that the spacecraft had been impacted by 
solar flare from our sun and from other suns. The camera checking and sometimes it whip out. The energy from other sun. The scientists always say that it comes from interstellar. Anything that come from outer space from our solar system boundary, they call interstellar. The interstellar may be another solar system in Milky Way or another solar system in Triangulum or Andromeda, <coughs> even from another universe. Keep in mind that the whole thing, not only one universe, we have multi universe at uncountable. In one universe, we have so many galaxies that uncountable. And the same in one galaxy, let's say our Milky Way, it still have uncountable solar system on star that you see on the sky. With the bright one, with the uh, let's say the, the light one, the other sun. So many sun. The sun could release any solar flare and solar system to the space. And when those sun or those stars are exposed, we call supernova. Those supernova, the charged particle that travel more than light speed, with the charged particle, with the nucleus. Most of them we say the cosmic ray. Cosmic ray is not really radiation as X-ray or gamma. It's a charged particle with nucleus and about eighty-five percent to 97% of those nucleus contain hydrogen. When hydrogen from space pour to the earth atmosphere, hydrogen mixing with oxygen, H2O, it creates moisture, water, and land. At the NOAA era, while the world flooding, before that, cosmic layer had been bombarded Earth. The scientists know that because when they dig to the ground, they can check the radiation in each soil layer, in each stone layer. And they found that so many cosmic layers had been bombarded Earth and it created raining about 40 days, 40 nights, something like that. It's a true story. And at each disaster that happened 1 million, 50 million, 500 million years ago, all life never died at all. Some life still survive, even the human or the animals. This is the, we check the energy from the sun that the lead from January 1st to January 11, you can see the anchor is pretty stable. Many things that we have to take a look and make the calculation and try to understand, try to learn to read this graph and information before we announce what will happen to us to Earth. For the aurora, and um, not really uh, made to be the main concern because it it happened after the energy from space pour to the north and pour to the south. You can see that two group of energy, right, that drop to the earth. Why there are two group of strong energy? So, if we have only one sun, how could we have two groups of energy? You can see that? The purple, like this. Do we have two suns? Something like that. Because the energy that hit Earth, they got two groups of energy at different location, different anchor. So, it should be some other, other star behind the sun, above the sun, or under the sun, 
and release the energy almost the same direction as the sun to earth. It might be Nibiru, might be Anunnaki or the Ra or whatever you say or whatever you believe in your information. They are not the same. As I had uh, read many history and uh, ancient information in the cave or some uh, Sumerian, we found that Anunnaki and Nibiru are not the same. La and Anunnaki are not the same. Many star, many spacecraft has rotate or orbit to Earth. When the asteroid is not daily asteroid, it some of them is spacecraft and cover like that. The same as the moon. We have been teach at school that the moon occurred because of some big asteroid hit Earth, right? And spat Earth to be the some small piece to be the moon. But the moon it cycle. Earth it doesn't. Not a good shape. Which area of the Earth? Pacific Ocean? And the ocean? Indian Ocean, any part of the Earth that separate or split out to be cycled at the Moon, not any location on Earth has no shape at the cycle. Think about it. This is the how radiation from solar flare impact life on Earth. Because right now, our Earth, North Hampshire, move away from the Sun. Therefore, most energy hit the area below the equator to the South Hampshire. But anyway, the radiation you spread all over the area, more than 10,000 miles. This is the information that I have to monitor from NASA too. This is uh, about the, something that happened with the, let's say, anomaly or abnormal. So some energy, it should be something like this, but the fact is like this. Why so many energy poor to the Northern American? It's really dry area. <coughs> Sorry. The energy from the space, most of them pour into the North, North Pole. Don't forget that our Earth magnetic shield had been produced inside the Earth by the Earth core and they live at the South Pole going back to the North Pole. So the North Pole should be the, what is that? The way in, right? The, in and out, out here and in here, right this. Therefore, many energy from space it easily to get to Earth through the North Pole. But don't forget that even the South Pole is the way out, but energy could be get in through it too. Energy that come in at the North Pole and the South Pole release at equator. That's why equator so many forests, so many lanes. And it come out at equator. It come out equator. It can get in through equator too. Keep in mind that nothing uh unbelievable. You have to 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 realize the fact. The same as this uh solar wind. You can see that. In the back side, the sun should be right here, right? And the wind come from that area to hit Earth with the sun in this area. But at the back side, the color stayed that so strong, more than up front. So it means the energy come to hit Earth in the back. Look at the proton. Right now, 
turn the off proton on around the space hit earth and some proton hit earth in the back at night that's why you could not easily to get to bed or wake up at night see that the pressure all around the world but at night it pretty close to the earth's surface more than in the daytime because one of the shield very strong up front to protect the energy from the sun North Pole and South Pole magnetic field not magnetic right here it still indicate that it should be more extra from the sun to earth and keep in mind that the fact transport rotation not only at this angle not only from left to right many huge explosion many huge CME from the sun and those energy they lead to the speed and it will be rotated to earth soon if it happen at the far side it may be take 15 days 20 days it up to the east anchor maybe some 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 it's about 30 days but the longer it means the shorter that you have the effect to earth <clears throat> when the dumbbell up and down up and down so many times you can see that triple layer double layer earth generate when the dumbbell to protect any harmful from the spade when you see the triple layer or double layer it means those harmful energy come from different direction come from direction not only from our sun from other suns from the other star or from other interstellar and sometimes somehow in the back too look at the negative field right here you can see that the, the, the blue line the IMF from the sun Sometimes it broken before it hit earth, but so many in the back. Look at this color, the what is the color? This one, the blue one, the dark blue one. You can see that so many energy come to hit earth in the back. Right now, earth magnetic field at north and south it in good shape and sometimes somehow it separate into two cycle take a look at the north magnetic pole you can see that it not only cycle right now is unshapeable but we can say that north magnetic had been separate into two groups why we know that when pole shift will happen because we observe the sun in every 11 years the sun will have the the we can say the pole shift to north to south and south to north the magnetic will move something like this let's say that we have a two magnetic field before it turn around those two will split into four, six, and eight. After eight, it will flip over. Right now, Earth magnetic field has been something like that. North and south, you can see the shape. It not in a good shape. It not really look at the cycle at all. Like something squid. 
that something sweet and it's you no it happened by earth itself nothing come from the spirit you can see that not really tough one not really dark late or not really strong from the spirit it means our earth magnetic field pretty weak by itself how do i so sure about that because of the human resonance it stays the same the frequency should be 7.8 for many million years from 2017 it start to be lower than 7.8 and after 2019 it never go up to 7.8 it's below than that and sometimes it's spark now. I show you later on. Here. Human resonance or we can say the earth heartbeat. Almost below than one. From time to time it may be spark up because of some energy from spread put to the earth or because of some casting between uh, earth magnetic field uh, nearby the earth core think about when the people stay in ICU right and they have to monitoring their heartbeat it's pretty low and sometimes it's choking something like that when this one drops to zero at that time Sorry, at that time, to be the time for the worship. And this frequency had an uh, effect to human life, even the plant, especially heart, electric, and the brain. So, right now, many people who have the heart disease have been reported, passed away, the percentage very high. And the same with the high blood pressure. So when stroke happen, many people collapse immediately. Even they look healthy because of the frequency from the spirit, frequency from the earth, it not matching the frequency in each organ. In each organ, they had a different frequency. Liver have some frequency, right? Heart had another frequency. If the frequency is normal, we are healthy. Sometimes it's faster, sometimes it's slower. That's why we feel sick. We live in the frequency universe, electric universe. And one more thing. I have found that the, the shape of the wave from the let's say this one should be uh, from the west to the east from the west to the east the water move from this area from asia from australia to northern america and southern america so much look at the wave you can see that at the top of this wave this one uh, nearby between Russia and Japan and the same thing at the Northern America and Southern America the water move from this area to this area the wave is not really drop down as usually or even by the storm what that is mean is mean I believe that earth rotation is slower than normal when the rotation is slow the water could not be stopped so if you forward more forward to another side earth move this area so the water from the Asia and Australia move more a little bit to the 
Northern America and Southern America, even the water <coughs> from East Northern America moved to Europe. And the water from the Southern America moved to Africa. They are moving because of the Earth rotation is slower than normal. <coughs> Even it's not much, but we can observe about it. Think about yourself. So, what you should do to prepare yourself for the worst case scenario. Okay, right here, I shall say why Canada and US have to ground on the airplane. Most of the the pressure come down from the north to the America. Don't forget that on the east of Rocky Mountain, they are so dry, many diseases, less moisture. Any area with the less moisture, where the energy comes from the spade, it's a very tough one. In any area that have more moisture, more foliage, the, the energy from safe is spread out. Europe, warmer in winter. How they don't have snow in December and January. The temperature is about 14 to 18 Celsius. It never happened, right? I used to live in London for five years. I used to live in the Rotterdam for five years. So I have been lived for two continental. So I can make some comparison. In each year, in each season, what should happen? What should happen? I lived here about 1987 to 1991, and in London about uh, <clears throat> 2000 to 2004. My experience in Europe and Northern America. That's why they have to crowd the airplane to save the people's life and avoid the mega disaster. Because if if some accident happen how could they make the announcement I believe because at that time as I report on my Facebook page and Facebook my, my private Facebook right we have the solar fair for the Sun with the strong X-ray. At the same time, powerful, it means very high proton from space hit Earth. This proton or plasma or electric or electromagnetic or EMF or EMP, whatever you say that, will affect to the electric and on engine. Last year, I believe you can recall the news about the China, uh, what commercial ally, totally drop down with the head down like this. There are no energy at all. They could not control anything, even the hydraulic by manual. A month later, military aircraft had the same ha thing happen. They lost the power in suddenly and head down to the earth. Those energy from space will affect the airplane. And most energy pour to the Earth at the North Pole to the Northern America. That's why Canada and US have to ground the commercial ally. Attention peace, attention peace. The huge energy from space will pour to the Earth and will make your airplane could not work while function and will be dropped down. The passenger on on plane will be die. How could they announce like that? Right? The people will panic all around the world. So they say, oh, my computer has been found out malfunctioned. 
outage. So I could not make the air traffic control. So you should be on the ground and some airplane from the sky. When you landing, stay over there. Don't fly up again. In the real world, they could not release the, the true fact. They can tell you about 10%. They have to control, right? Otherwise, the chaos will happen. Keep in mind that. Some people say that in the conspiracy theory, yes, you can say that, but they want to save the other social to be calmed down. Why they spray to the air? Why somebody complain with the chemtail? They protect the radiation and they protect the electromagnetic force from space to be turned back out of the Earth's atmosphere. But those chemtail and those spray, of course, might affect some people, make some people sick. But if you think about the, the global, we have to save so many people. So we have to look over some very few people that maybe sacrifice for us, but we are not intent to sacrifice them. Okay, well, many people ask me when the push happened, what should be the best place to evacuate? They say, I say that you have to find the high cloud at least 2,000 feet avoid the huge tidal wave. If you watch the movie 2012 of Deep Impact or many other Greenland, many movies, we share have the tidal wave that one is higher, stronger, and bigger than tsunami. This is the area in the North America on the East Coast. Most of the East Coast have been impacted to the, to the center of America, Montana, New Mexico, Louisiana, Florida gone. You see that? Even from the Vermont, Pittsburgh, the area of the Great Lake, it's not good. You have to find a high cloud about at least 2,000 feet. We shall know in advance at least seven days that post ship will happen. You have at least seven days to 50 days to evacuate from the danger zone. In Europe, something like this. Even the Moscow is gone. Most of the world that survive from the Tidal Web are in Mongol, Mongolia, China, Bhutan, Nepal, Kashmir, something like that. You can see that. Most of the area has a Iceland. It is not the level of the new world flooding, but about the spread and the tidal wave. The, the <coughs> this area in the light blue, it used to be the dry land. The last world flooding the water come up about 177 meters. But before it stable like that, the wave is move around the same, almost at least about 2,000 feet above the main sea level. Even in, in Europe, they used to walk to each other from island to Finland to the north, but because of the world flooding. So right now, UK and Europe are separated by the Dover. 
next the water should come up about 235 meter Most of the United Kingdom and Ireland are gone. They will be small Iceland. Part of <coughs> Europe, so many parts will be under the sea level. This one, I mean after the splash, after the tidal wave, you can see that? Many earlier will be safe. I inform you that you have to evacuate to above 20 feet to avoid the wave, avoid the splash water, that the water come from the ocean, hit the mountain and spread up to the air and going down to you. But I said it's a safe zone, but the water not really come up to, to that that high but you have to be safe for your sleep for your good sleep this to be the new map of the new world Australia <coughs> this one indicate about the flooding okay on around the world not the poor ship not the poor ship because of the the software could not generate those things after the poor ship two-thirds of the Australian will be submerged underwater as Alexandria in Egypt right here it look all oh, is safe it's no the whole continental view bends down like this. Poor ship, many land will going down, some land will come up. Australia, this area, northern, southern and western will submerged. So on the New South Wales, on the east area, it will be the same place. You have to look by yourself to the Google about the poor ship of the water day happen and you have to think about yourself. When you move to the new area, you have to live there forever. When the water come over your house, it brings mud, trees, many animals to your house. If you cover, when the water go down, you cannot see your house. It will be mud all over the place, sand, stone, so when you move to the safe zone you will set up the new village the new society and live there forever for the next generation and next generation to do the good thing do whatever your religion teach you tell you to do not about the leader not because of the archbishop say that, not because of the pope say that, not because of the uh, imam say that, not because of the head monk say that. Believe at your God word. Because all religion, they teach their people, they teach their follower to be the good man, to save the friend to save the world, to save the nature. But the religion leader use some belief as their uh, what they mean, as their weapon to make their wealthy, richer, make their look to be the leader, to be the superman or super people and another people down below them, something like that. Heal yourself and your God will heal you. I've been said that 
eyes open. We save everyone.